Hello. Today we're going to look at exchanging out a LCD screen in an ATM machine. I'm working with a buddy of mine and uh, his LCD screen uh, went, went bad. Half of it was able to display and the other half not. So um, yeah, hopefully this video will help you the first thing that you're going to have to do is the, you have two brackets here that needs to be uh, undone. Uh, so let's go ahead and unscrew these. Sorry for the bumping, bumpiness. Very carefully just kind of maneuver these out a little bit. Alright, now we want to take off this back plate. And usually there's a screw at the bottom of this one, but uh, there's a screw that goes right there. The uh, That screw is missing on this particular ATM machine. So we look at, uh, we're seeing the what I call the motherboard here. Um, you have some of these wires that are connected to the motherboard. You're not going to have to remove all of them for this uh, process. Um, but the ones that uh, you will move, and I will show you, uh, are, is this one right here up at the top. Let me take that out this one here and this one on this side there we go all right and that should be good enough so that way we will be able to take out the um, the LCD screen portion of it. Let's go ahead uh, and remove the motherboard because this right here, as you can see where I'm uh, outlining, that part right there is going to have to come all the way out just to get to the LCD screen. So let's go ahead, take these screws out. And again, this one here only came <laughs> is only has three screws attached to the motherboard. So I want to be careful here not to damage it. All right. And then back underneath here, that is the LCD monitor connection so we have four screws that needs to be um, taken out so we can get to the LCD frame and then we'll be able to go to the bench uh, and look at the LCD screen there. I'll meet you back at my bench. All right. I'm here at my uh my workbench. Um one of the things that you want to do when you um, take out the LCD screen is you want to look for a particular um, model number and this is the model number that I needed to to go out and to search for on uh, Google it's uh, N101 LGE-L11 
Um, this particular model uh, is uh, just kind of a standard model out there. It's easy to find. Uh, LaptopScreen.com. They had, um, I mean, it pulled up real quick underneath their name. Uh, great price. So, um, yeah, that's that's what you need to do. You just need to make sure that you can find this exact same model number and and order it. Um, um, so that way, when you get it and get the new one, uh, it'll work exactly like this one. So. Uh, to do this, what you have to do is to unscrew each of these four tiny screws, and you got to be careful because they can get away from you really quick. Like, uh, so I'm going to go ahead and take this out and do the other side now. And the last one. All right, now we have all four of those out. I'll be able to push out a little bit, and there you have it. And that's the 40 pin connector, which we took off a while ago from the ATM machine. But yeah, there it is, and this is the frame. So I'm gonna put this aside right now. Make sure I don't lose those, and this is uh, the box that I received from uh, LaptopScreens.com. Hey, another one. Nicely done, though. Making use of bubble wraps. Oh, nice. Nice, nice, nice. So, and verify. That's the same number. That's the same number. Hopefully, I got it in the shot. That's the same number that we were looking for. All right. And one thing that you can see uh, from the other one is uh, this weather stripping. I, I assume that that's what it is and protection. Uh, we don't have that, but um, yeah, I was trying to find on the internet where I could get some, but I, if anybody knows where we can get some of these, uh, let us know. Put it in the comments below and uh, help me out and help others out too. All right, so let's go ahead and put this back into place here. All right, we got it all screwed in, and uh, it's in the right, right position. This is the top part of it, um, and so our cable is going to come over here and, and plug right on in. So, all right, I'll meet you back at the um, at the uh, ATM. It looks like we have a fully functional LCD screen now. We don't have the uh, lines ha as we had them before. And uh, you can actually see the whole screen. So this project was pretty fun. I enjoyed it. This was my first video of instructional. Hopefully you uh, will benefit from it. If not, sorry. Um, if you have any questions, just leave them in the comments. And we'll help you out. Hope you enjoyed. Thanks. Bye.